Hello and welcome to California Bountiful. I'm your host, Aubrey Aquino. Tractors play a huge role in farm operations. Here in the Napa Valley, innovators like Bexhoffer Vineyards are looking to the future, embracing technology to help drive the way they farm. The idea of driverless tractors isn't as new as one might think, but the concept has significantly evolved in the last few years. I never thought I would be using autonomous or electric tractors out in the vineyard, so it's, it's really cool to see what um, technology has been able to offer farmers. Connor Birkin is the viticulturist at Bextoffer Vineyards, where they grow wine grapes for vintners to turn into exceptional wines. For 30 years, Bextoffer's been cultivating wine grapes on hundreds of acres in Napa Valley, and now they're employing a fleet of the world's first fully electric, driver-optional tractors to keep growing. We use the tractors for pulling out vines, doing row management uh, as far as weed control, and um, harvesting. We have 10 Monarch tractors that are all electric, and so uh, we made the decision because we are a no-till operation now, and with that, it requires more tractor passes to manage our weeds. And we thought, you know, we don't want to increase our diesel usage, so it, it seemed right to get Monarch tractors. We've saved about $12,000 in diesel um, just in the 2023. This vineyard is one of the early adopters. I would say that we definitely kind of spearheaded it um, and that we're really grateful for the opportunity to do so. So far, it's been very low maintenance. Uh, we will use the tractor for the whole eight hour shift. Uh, end of the day, we'll come and plug it in. And by the next morning, the tractor is fully charged and, and ready to go. So it's um, less maintenance than a diesel tractor. When we first got them, I think the biggest concern was, will they last a full workday? Um, are we going to have to, you know, plan around the tractor's battery? But essentially, we've seen it, you know, work the entire working day, and, and it's, it's been great. This autonomous tractor rollout can also be found powering other ag sectors worldwide, like dairy farms to push feed, a blueberry farm in Florida, and cherry orchards in New Zealand. Not only are we reducing our diesel costs, um, but we have the uh, autonomous function now, so we're actually saving money on labor every time we use them. No one's losing their jobs. It's, um, it's basically just letting us be more efficient with our time uh, because there's always going to be lots of work that needs to get done. You know, freeing up some of that time to do some of the extra work that we need to do is awesome. The electric vehicles also provide portable energy between the vines. The tractors have a, um, a 110 volt plug on it, so you can power, for us, we use it to power lights. Anything that would use a generator, we're basically replacing it with a monitor tractor. And the benefits of advanced farming technology don't stop there. I'm not just like, you know, listening for a tractor out in the field or driving around aimlessly trying to find someone. It's, um, yeah, I, I know where I'm going and can head straight there. We're also able to start the tractors autonomously, so we'll drive them to the vineyard block that we're using them in, um, tell Wingspan AI what row uh, that the tractors are starting in and, and how many rows we want it to go down and where we want it to stop. So we're able to do that all from uh, the power of Wingspan AI. It's just like using an iPad. Uh, it's really easy. Um, it's all self-explanatory, uh, in my opinion. Being new to tractors, seeing a diesel tractor, I was really confused what all the levers did. But um, when you're sitting in the Mark V, you know, the, the screen tells you what every lever does and what each button does. So it was a really easy learning curve. It's really great driving it, um, especially when you're in the vineyard rows. Uh, we can turn on row follow and um, it's essentially, I don't even have to touch the steering wheel. Um, I just keep my, uh, you know, eyes where I'm going and the tractor will keep me straight and I just keep my foot on the pedal. 